There's one. All right, everybody, I'm at a local lake. It's closed because of all the craziness going on. But uh, I'm taking the long walk down to the water. Since I got such a long walk, I gotta make sure I got everything I need. So I did that. Rule number 31 of Zombie Land. Check the back seat. And I got such a long walk down to get to the water. Rule number one of Zombie Land, cardio. All right, I got some pliers and scissors and all the stuff I need. But if somebody else asks me if I have some pliers or some scissors, I'm telling them no. Don't be a hero. All right, going by the conditions today, it was 80 degrees yesterday, it's 50 degrees now. I think it's gonna be a jerkbait bite. And I'm tripling up on that. I got three different jerkbaits tied up. I have a deep jerkbait. Got a small jerk bait and I got a large jerk bait. So I should be all good there. I'm also gonna be throwing around a big old Huddleston. See if I can't get a giant bite. So um alright, I'll see you when we get to the water. We're gonna start off with this uh Huddleston 68. See if I can't get a big bite right off the bat. plus one since we're out here on this out here on this pier got the shark cruise bottom it always works good in the spring I've had really good days off this pier throwing this bait before Rule number two of Zombie Land: Double tap. There's one. Oh, 
Come on, buddy. I got both look. These crazy times you never know which fish is gonna be your last for a few weeks. So I'm glad I got one today. There you go. Ooh, almost got me. About a pound and a half. Alright, let's let him go. All right, everybody. I'm gonna try this Mega Bass Dark Sleeper. I've used one before. I didn't get I didn't get bit. I'm gonna give it another shot. This thing gets through the gets through the grass pretty well. You can feel it when it hits the grass. Give it a Get a little pull, comes right through it. That's pretty good. All right, everybody. It's crazy times. I've been coming here for years. I mean, it's closed, technically. There's no staff or anything. But I've been coming here for years, and it's a ghost town. There were some people here when I got here. There were some people walking their dogs and walking the trails. There's no kids on the playgrounds. I'm the only one fishing. There was a dad fishing with his kids when I got here, but they're gone. I'm the only person in sight. I just peed off the corner of the pier because one, there's nobody else here. And two, third rule of zombie land is avoid bathrooms. So, uh, but like I said, been here for about an hour and a half. The place is empty. I've got that one fish, but I'm, I'm going to stay till dark. I mean, this is probably the safest place in the world right now. There's nobody here. So, uh, all right. Rule number 20 of zombie land is it's a marathon, not a sprint. Unless it's a sprint, then it's a sprint. Well, I'm going to get back at it and see what else I can catch. Well, there ain't no staff here today. Rule number 16 of Zombie Land Opportunity Knocks. I'm done. It's really strange seeing this place so empty. It's usually full of people. Well, I need to work on rule number one, cardio. This hill's kicking my butt. Earlier I said uh, one of the rules was don't be a hero. Scratch that out. Be a hero. Check on your uh, elderly relatives and neighbors. Make sure they got everything they need so they don't got to go out in this madness. Well, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Oh, and don't forget rule number 31. Enjoy the little things. That fish I caught might be my last fish I catch for a couple weeks. I don't know, I might be locked down. A lot of people already are. So, uh, till next time, whenever next time is, thanks for watching Hookset TV.